Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. Edo Primaries. APC Diaz Obaseki refused to apply for permits. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time we're reaching you today. Um, the elections of Edo State is quite an interesting one. And uh, at Apple Line Media, we promise to keep you up to date with everything regarding this election. So we please want to ask for your, uh, if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. We really, truly appreciate you. My people, the election in Edo State, hmm, we are keeping a close eye and a keen interest because of all the characters and all the players involved. It's quite an interesting one. We know that Governor Gordon Obaseki has said for political gathering and things that will be done in the election with regards to the num large number of people coming together in a single location, there should be permits, appropriate permits gotten from the government with regards to that. We all know that APC primaries is tomorrow and um, up until now, there is no permit being applied for and APC is daring uh, Baseki saying, you know what, do your worst. We're not going to apply for any permit. Well, the elections is quite uh, an interesting one because just today we got uh, an information stating that um, Pius Odubu has left the race, leaving only um, Pastor Eze Iyamu. Well, that was not true because Eze Iyamu quickly gave a statement which we have also reported there was no such thing. He did not quit the race. It's all an attempt to move him off the race so that uh, they can be the only consensus candidates. So there is a lot of um, untrustworthiness and uh, things flying here and there. Anyway, my people, APC has refused to take a permit. If I were Basaki, I would let them go because you can see that you don't uh, cry over uh, spilled milk. Let's get on to the news and get all the details. Ahead of the governorship primaries of the All Progressive Congress in Edo State on Monday tomorrow, the party has dismissed the order glazed there by the state government that political parties must obtain approval of the governor to hold any political gathering. The APC man maintained that it did not require any permit from the state governor, Gordon Obaseki, to hold his direct primaries as it performed as his preferred mood of choosing the candidates for the September 19, 2020 election in the state. Obaseki had in a glacier signed on May the 28th and published on June the 5th bound political gathering that will make direct primary possible in the state, stipulating that only indirect could be held in the state and any other one location especially in Benin City. The other parties have complied that in respect of the political gathering of the for the purpose of managing the spread of COVID-19 and conducting primaries of any form by any party should have an appropriate permission taken. taken. However, the APC has not complied, insisting that they don't need any permit from anybody. 20 persons may be allowed subject to the written approval of the governor if such gathering do not exceed 5,000 persons held in Benin City and in a single facility with a large sitting capacity of not less than 10,000 per persons are provided with adequate, adequate health care sanitization and facilities to avoid the spread of coronavirus in the state. The governor has explained that the law was in line with the determination of the administration to sp stop the spread of coronavirus. But the APC argued that it was a political move to stop it from conducting a direct primary to choose its candidates. The independent not the independent National Electoral Commission has reviewed that of the that rev revealed that out of the 15 political parties participating in the election, 14 chose indirect primaries 
only APC chose the direct primaries. But responding to Sunday Punch inquiries by Saturday, on Saturday, the APC acting national chairman Abiola Jimobi, who spoke through the national vice chairman South South Heather Etta, had in a telephone news interview said that the APC is a law abiding party, believed not only believed that only the federal government are, are, was currently empowered to enact the kind of order Gordon Obaseki is ordering the Glazier. He said under the law, it is operational of Nigeria today. It is only the federal government that has power to make law under pandemics such as coronavirus. And as it is today, the Glazier of Obaseki has, been, has not been signed with more than 50 persons gathering at a single place. In any case, since we, are, we now have only one aspirant left, we don't have to have any permits. Well, this um, word that uh, Eta was saying is wrong. So I can tell you that there is a conspiracy theory going on in APC. They want to make only uh, a pastor, Eze Iyamu, the consensual candidate. But why? Why are they not giving Pius Odubu the opportunity to contest? You heard the news. This is the person acting in the capacity of uh, Oshomole or Abiola Jimobi. This is the person acting. Did you hear the end of the news? He said, since they have only one candidate. So does it mean that if we are just hearing APC results already? That the result is favoring as we speak without even being conducted tomorrow? That Pastor uh, Ize Iyamu is the consensual candidate. And so it doesn't matter what is being done. My people, you can see, you know, when somebody is speak, speaking, you can de de deduce from the line of the conversation where the person is heading to. When somebody starts giving you a parable and start talking about a certain kind of matter, you begin to infer where the person is actually going to, where this is actually leading to. Pa Dr. Pius Odubu gave a statement today that is still very much in the race, but I can tell you, Please reason with your mind and open your heart and hear for yourself. Do you think in APC's mind, Dr. Pius is not a figurehead? They are just saying he's in the race to make it look like they have more than one person. This was the same reason, part of the reasons, I won't say it's all the reasons, why the person of Gordon Obaseki was taken out of the race. Because for some reasons, some pre people want uh, Pius Udubu. Uh, want Pastor Ize Iyamu, yes, to be their governor, which is not a bad thing if everybody agrees and votes for him and go ahead and line up and say, yes, this is the person we want. Well, APC has issued a, a strong statement saying that uh, it's only that there's no need for them to get Iglesia, it's only one candidate. What Pius Odubu is saying, I'm still very much in the race. Dr. Pius, wherever you are, I just wanted to hear, you, hear it loud and clear. I don't think you are recognizing APCO. It's my opinion or I might be wrong. But what I'm hearing, they don't recognize that you are even part of the race. So they just allowed you scale through because they have no choice. If I'm to speak, if I'm to actually sincerely tell you how I feel. You heard the person who is acting now in the place of Adam Sushomole, in the place of Ajimobi, saying that, well, there is no need for us conducting the primary because we have only one candidate. But you issued a statement saying today that you are still very much in the race. I can tell you loud and clear that you are not recognized in your party. They feel you are not recognized. They feel you don't have a place. My people, this is what is going on. Can you imagine? You are in a party and you are not recognized as part of the party. Now they are daring, uh, uh, they are daring the person of Gordon Obaseki. Gordon Obaseki, let them be... Just, just allow peace to reign. You, it's very clear from all indications that somebody somewhere wants trouble. Please, don't let them give you a bad name. Please. Godwin Obaseki, if I were you, this is me speaking, Apple Line Media, from Apple Line Media, I will let Sleeping Dog lie. Within a few days, within a few months, all this will be made known. We will know who the governor of Edo State is. But we just pray that everything is done fair and transparent. So Dr. Pius Odubu is not even recognized by his, par by his party. 
he said he's very much in the race, but you just heard uh, he that Hector saying that Hector saying that um, they don't even need any permit since they are not going to be having the primaries. It's only one consensual candidate. This is the secret of what they have said. He mistakenly said it. He did not know when he said it. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button. God bless you. Have a good day. Bye for now.